if the point is i cannot raise the privacy issue i understand but i don't think we are such a draconian country yet uh, satyajit ray's uh, very famous film is hirok raja desh uh, which is uh, satire it cannot be made now uh, even rangde basanti I, i also think cannot be made now was communicated to me by geo studios later on a phone call that uh, um they got a phone call from ui dai and uh, after the trailer was released so they wanted to see the film in delhi which they did and uh, they wanted uh, several uh, cuts to be uh, made Geo Studios told me that they have received, you know, uh, a formal uh, written thing, and I was expecting, and I pleaded them that, you know, I I need to see the cuts, um, and uh, it was never sent to me. Only verbally, it was read out from there by Geo. um to be honest it was my ignominy that i did not know that um after the censor the government cannot um at least still now cannot pull off a film i was under the impression that this is the process um because previously i had a similar instance where uh, uh, one of my documentary on amartya sen was um, censored by the kolkata censor office then i complained and for me it worked wonderfully because i said that i will not make any cuts then to the documentary argumentary indian it was taken to bombay and in bombay uh, you know i had a meeting with prashun joshi and the enter committee uh, it was a wonderful meeting and prashun joshi you know uh, i think one cut he found uh, and we discussed about it otherwise he loved the documentary and we had a very enlightened discussion on that so uh, i was under the similar impression that you know but of course later did i realize it's not the same thing because my film is completely censored i'm willing to at least talk to the government uh, whoever it is the right person and uh, getting myself heard but my uh, frustration now is that uh, you know i'm you know i'm just waiting for somebody from uidi i wrote a letter to them also um the ceo i wrote an email i'll write again and i'll go on this process in my fictional village there is a discussion going on amongst the villagers about the privacy issue so a school teacher tells them that uh, you know in in hindi that uh, आपका निजिता का हनन हो सकता है एंड यू नो गवर्नमेंट दखल अंदाजी कर सकता है ये लिखा हुआ है एक न्यूज पेपर में दे ही वाज नरेटिंग इट टू द विलेजर्स इन अ पंचायत मीटिंग सो वन ऑफ द विलेजर्स सेज दैट यू नो हाउ डज इट मैटर टू अस दिस प्राइवेसी इशू बिकॉज यू नो हम लोग वी कॉन्ट ईट प्रॉपरली एंड वॉट विल बी डू विद प्राइवेसी और क्या होगा सरकार घुसल खाने में घुस जाएगा क्या so will the government come into so you see the uh, you know if the point is i cannot raise the privacy issue i understand but i don't think we are such a draconian country yet but this is complete this does not mean that literally the government will come into your bathrooms right and if that is objectionable that statement what do i say so uh, but you know even with this i would like to uh, discuss it explain myself like i am doing to you that it is not insulting the government it it is in a sense 
you know, giving the perspective of the villager about what uh, the privacy issue means to them. There was another example where, um, you know, our protagonist, Harsua, is giving a dialogue that I am a manch mein. It was uh, taken from uh, the Amitabh Bachchan movie, Main Azad Hoon. And if you remember, that movie also was of a like John Doe type of character. And uh, so it was just taken like that. And there was an objection to that line, Main Aadhar Hu. Again, if I talk to them, I will find out that what is the objection in the sense that are you implying that the Aadhar program is being insulted because a person is saying Main Aadhar Hu? There is a dialogue where uh, one of the government officials is saying when the villagers are not taking the Aadhar card because they are uh, a little bit apprehensive about uh, what this card will achieve. So he says that, uh, you know, Baad, to, to the Sarpanj that, you know, please tell them to take the card uh, after, um, you know, but later when the government makes it mandatory, then you will need it for, you know, uh, um, you know, for everything you need it. So, ek satark de rahe par sarpanj ko. Um, you know, so there, there was an objection to that. I use the Aadhaar as a tool in this film to explore India in its vicissitudes. And let me tell you why, because uh, again, being a development economist, teaches, researchers, I've published in development economics. Um, I'm a student of Kaushik Basu, if you know, he was the economic yes. advisor to India. So in, in Cornell, when I did my PhD in economics, you know, one of the major issues of enrolling a program like Aadhaar or anything like that, digital identification of the one of the major issues is that people are superstitious. There are many concerns which people have, which you need to communicate with people properly so that it becomes, rollout becomes easier. It becomes a voluntary process and hence you do that. So I just wanted to uh, explore in a completely humorous manner. It's a completely comedy film, uh, you know, uh, but uh, so that was the point of the film. You know, deeper down, it is a pro Aadhaar film uh, with the caveat that I told you. Uh, so I needed to talk to the government and explain to them that uh, something is, you know, lost in translation there, uh, which which I need to communicate. Oftentimes, you know, um, the censorship comes at a very subtle level where even at the writing stage, if I or any writer, uh, you know, is writing something uh, which borderlines on some controversy, uh, which is harmless, maybe in this my Aadhaar case, I can guarantee that it is harmless. This controversy it shouldn't have been, you know, made such a fuss about it, it uh, you know. So uh, they would avoid that. And so you can see that the topics of films that will be made, it will be completely devoid of uh, fundamental films which have been made throughout, you know, in, in uh, for example, in Bengal, I'm a Bengali filmmaker, I can say many films uh, have been um, a satire, uh, Satyajitre's uh, very famous film is Hirok Rajat Deshi, uh, which is a satire, it cannot be made now. Uh, even Rangde Basanti, I, I also think, cannot be made now. Uh, it was made in 2005 or something like that, I think. Um, and, and many other, and I just gave you two examples. In Bengal, there are many examples. And, you know, uh, so that is uh, something definitely to worry about uh, for sure.